Hello everyone and welcome. You guys know that I'm always looking for the best deals in technology and security. So today I bring you the cheapest high resolution pan and tilt security camera that I found on Amazon. This security camera has a ton of features and it does it for a fraction of the price of what other cameras charge. This camera also has one feature that a lot of cameras are missing and that is 24-7 recording functionality. Most cameras only turn on when they sense activity and turn off the rest of the time. This camera can be set to record all day and all night so that you don't miss anything at all, which is something that some of you guys, my viewers, have been asking me for. So let's unbox this puppy and see how it performs. But before we do that, if you enjoy watching honest tool and product reviews plus helpful DIY projects, be sure to hit that subscribe button so you get notified every time I produce another product review video or DIY video. Alright, so let's see what we have here. Here's a shot of the box for you. Let's open this puppy up and see what I got this time. Alright guys, so when you unbox this puppy, this is everything you get. Now this is the 2K outdoor security camera from Galliu, available on Amazon, link in description below. At the time of making this video, this camera kit retails for $39.99, which is a bargain compared to many other cameras on Amazon that have similar features to this one. They generally sell for close to 100 bucks, so this is a really good deal right here. So when you unbox this puppy, this is what you get. You get the owner's manual that tells you everything about the camera, getting it hooked up, setting it up with your Wi-Fi, all that kind of good stuff, and I'm going to talk about that more later on, so hold on for that. And you also get the camera itself. You get the USB charging cable, you get the brick to power it up, and you get some hardware to get it all set up and mounted wherever it is that you want to put that camera. Now the dimensions on this camera are actually fairly compact. It's only 4 inches in width, 6 inches in height, and 5 inches in depth. So it's actually very compact. I've seen other cameras that are much bigger and bulkier than this, so this doesn't take up much room at all. This camera is IP65 waterproof, and the operating temperature on this camera is from minus 20 degrees centigrade to 50 degrees centigrade. So it doesn't matter what the weather conditions are outside, this camera is made to hold up to it. This camera is also compatible with Google Home or Alexa. And you can also use the app that I'll tell you about a little bit later on to control this. So you have three different ways of controlling this camera. The resolution on this camera is 2K or 3 megapixels HD video, which comes out to be 2304 by 1296p. So that's actually very good resolution from this camera. This camera also does pan and tilt. It has a 335 degrees horizontal pan or 90 degrees vertical tilt. So you can see pretty much any part of the area that you're trying to view with this camera. You're not fixed in one particular location. It also has a very convenient feature that it has four favorite spots that you can pick. For example, if you have a very large area that you're trying to view, instead of having a drag on the app or telling it exactly where to go that you want to view it, you can pick four areas that are your favorites and all you do is touch the button, tell it where you want it to go and the camera goes directly to see those areas without you having to maneuver it and tell it where to go. So four favorites that you can pick for more easy quick viewing. That's a very convenient feature of this app. This camera also has very nice color day and night vision plus it also has infrared night vision. So when there's a little bit of lighting around, it'll give you color night vision. But when there's absolutely no light whatsoever, it'll switch over to infrared night vision. And we'll take a look at that a little bit later on. This camera also does have floodlight and siren that you can select to have on or off. You don't have to have it on all the time if you don't want to. But it has a floodlight and siren, so if it senses any intruders, it can scare them away. It also has very convenient two-way audio so you can talk to whoever's on the other side of the camera without having to actually physically go out there and do so. This camera has two convenient video recording methods. It either has motion detection where it turns on and off where it senses motion or you can set it to 24-7 recording where it's recording all the time. It doesn't stop. That way you don't miss a single bit of footage. And you also have convenient recording where you can record on the cloud or on an SD card. And it has a slot right here at the bottom for putting the SD card into it. It doesn't bring an SD card, so you have to supply your own. But you can do that way if you don't want to have to pay for cloud storage. 
It does have multi-user access where you can have other members of your family, friends, relatives, whoever access the camera and see the footage if you want to share that with them. It also has financial grade encryption for your data for security reasons so that way nobody can hack in and see the data that you're looking at. So this camera is really great for monitoring both large and small properties. You can pan and tilt to view any area you want, even if it's outside the camera's normal viewing range. You can record 24-7 so you don't miss anything, and it can scare away intruders with the floodlights and the siren. So whether you're protecting your home, your shop, your office, your entryway, watching over your cars, animals, or just about anything that you want to keep an eye on, this camera can handle it both day and night. So let's get this camera hooked up and see how it performs. All right, guys, let's talk about how to get this guy set up so you can start using your camera. It's extremely easy to do. All you're going to do is look at your owner's manual, and there's a QR code on here that you're going to scan. And if that doesn't come out clear for you for some reason, maybe you crumpled it up or something, well, the QR code is also on the side of the box. So either way, you have plenty of QR codes that you can scan. Scan that and download the app onto your phone or tablet. And it works for either Google or Apple, so either way, you're covered whatever product it is that you have. Then it's very easy from there. You're going to set up an account with the app just like every other app you've ever done. Email, password, that kind of good stuff. Get yourself set up, log into the account. And then on the owner's manual, there are pictures that guide you through every step that you're going to follow. But I'm going to tell you real quick how easy it is to get it set up. Once you're in the app and you have everything set up, it's going to ask you for your Wi-Fi name, password, all that kind of good stuff. Then once you get through all of that, when you're ready to go, it'll tell you right on the screen of your phone or tablet to tap you when you're ready for the next step. It'll put a QR code on the screen of your phone or tablet, point that towards the camera so it can read it, and it will talk to you and tell you pairing successful. That's it. That's how easy it is to do. Nothing more you need to do from there. I imagine they would talk to you and tell you if there was a problem, but I had no trouble whatsoever. Pairing successful, a few seconds later it starts getting all set up on the cloud and so forth, and then before you know it, you start seeing images that come through the camera itself. So I had no trouble, within a couple of minutes I was all set up and ready to go. So I'm sure it'll be easy for you as well. So let's start getting this guy hooked up and see exactly what the images look like. All right, guys, so here we have the camera mounted in my shop so we can get a real close look at how it looks and all the different things that it can do. Uh, first of all, looking at the front of it right there, you can see that it has six LEDs. Four of them are white LEDs that light up and give you white light. Two of them are infrared LEDs that light up at night when there's no other light around. So four of them would light up for the spotlight, and I'll show you what that looks like in just a moment. And then I'm going to show you the siren as well. So let's light up the LEDs and see what those guys look like. And there you go. Let me turn off the lights. And there you see they're kind of blinding when you're looking straight at them. But I'm going to show you later on at night how they light up the outdoors when they're mounted outside. So right now, this is what you see how they light up at night. And then you saw those little uh, infrareds blinking right there. So let's take a quick listen to the siren right now and see what that sounds like. There you have it. That's what the siren sounds like. If you had it set up to scare someone away, that's what they would be hearing. And obviously the sound is attenuated by the microphone on the camera, so it sounds a little bit louder in person than you're probably hearing it on the camera itself. But there you have it. That's what it sounds like. All right, let's take a look at some footage going through the camera itself. All right, guys, here we are looking through the camera app itself, and we're looking at my garage right now, and I have all the lights and everything on. And you see all the controls on the screen. If you want to make those controls go away, all you have to do is tap on the screen, and they go away. So right now we have all the lights on, and you see what a beautiful image it gives you. And I'm going to turn off the lights in just a moment and see if it switches to low light mode or if it goes to infrared mode. It has intelligent lighting set up, so it will select it by itself how much light it needs or it doesn't need. Right here we're in still in color mode, but let's see if it holds it. No, it went over to infrared. So it's not enough lighting in the garage right now for it to go to full color night mode. But I'm going to show you outside at night what it looks like with color night mode. Right now it's set up for infrared, so it goes to black and white. But if I turn on the floodlight, then we're going to see what that looks like. And right there, I clicked on the floodlight, you see the light comes on, and it lights up the entire shop. So those four LEDs give you some really good lighting, 
And then when the floodlight kicks on, it gives you full color night vision. So that's the beauty of having that. You can either have it do it automatically or you control it yourself manually, your choice. You have a lot of freedom to control a lot of things in the app. So let's take a look at the camera outside and see what it can do during the day and at night. All right, guys, so here you see the camera mounted outside, and this is what it would look like if you mounted it somewhere on your property. So this gives you a close-up idea of what the camera looks like. And now we're looking through the app, and you're looking at my backyard right now in full HD video in the middle of the day, and you can see what a beautiful shot this gives you. And I'm just going to show you basically how clear a beautiful shot it has, and I'm going to show you the convenience of having a pan and tilt camera, because all you do is turn on the controls, have them pop up on the screen, and then you can tilt and pan, go from side to side, go up and down, and you can see anything in your property that you need to do that. You don't need to be limited by a camera that only has one full focal point with this one you can move around look up and down look anywhere that you need to and you can watch a much larger area instead of some other cameras where you're limited to where you can only see whatever the camera is fixed on because it can't move so pan and tilt cameras are very very convenient when it comes to that functionality and here if you want to see something below the camera you just pan down and that's how you see it there pan back up and we're back to where we started from so there you have it. Very convenient, very beautiful picture right there. All right, guys. So here we are at night, around 9 o'clock at night, and you see that there is no lighting around, so therefore the camera switches over to the infrared lighting. My backyard gets very dark at night, so it's very hard for any color camera to work at night in full color mode. But I'm going to turn on the floodlights right now, and you're going to see how it looks when there is some lighting around and turn on the controls and we go over to flood mode and you see what a beautiful picture it gives you when you have some lighting. When you turn on the lights or when there's ambient light around, then you get full color night vision and it gives you a really nice, clear, sharp image at night in full color mode. And remember, you can always pan and zoom and go anywhere you want to see what's going on in your property. So you have beautiful color night vision and you can see whatever's going on very clearly. Any intruders, any activity going on, you can see it very well at night with this camera. So there you have it. All right, guys, there you have it. A review and demonstration of the Galu 2K outdoor security camera. The cheapest 2K pan and tilt camera I could find on Amazon. I think this is a great little camera. This camera has the features of much more expensive cameras, but at a fraction of the cost. You get a 2K HD resolution, full color day and night modes, pan and tilt function, plus 24 seven video recording. So you never miss anything. What more could you ask for? If you've been looking for a full featured video security camera, but didn't like the high cost of other cameras, then I think you should really look at this one. Check out their Amazon page for complete details. Hope you enjoyed the video. Hit that thumbs up button, hit that subscribe button, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye-bye for now.